there get a chance to sit down with comedian Pat Dixon. He's had his own half-hour Comedy Central special. He's been on The Late Late Show with Craig Ferguson and countless other programs. I've got him here. I'm talking to him. I'm in his apartment bugging him. Check out the interview. Hello, uh, my name's Ted. I'm here interviewing comedian Pat Dixon. He's been on Comedy Central. He's been all around the world. He's a comedian of epic proportions. Here he is. He's live. He's talking to me. You don't He's, know anything about me, do you? I, well, I found your apartment, and I knocked, and you let me in. So. Did, you, did you even go online and maybe read a bio or something? <clears throat> a resume, a list of credits? I, de- I, well, I don't have internet yet. Um, I've uh, heard it's... I go to this cafe sometimes, and I get on... So what, what are some of the things that you find are cool? Because you, you seem like a cool guy, and, and I'm trying to get cool. I've got my jacket, I've got my hair, but I, I feel not quite... You see, like, I'm not that laid back right now. I'm, right, right. I'm no, kind of tense. A little and... tense. You know what I think is cool? What I really think is cool? The ability to blink. It's pretty awesome. I always wish I could it. do that. Yeah, yeah, it's great. Let me try. Let me... You're almost... <sighs> Give it a shot. <laughs> Damn, man. I, can't... I, I thought you were going to do it that time. I, can't, I came really close. I usually have to put tape over my eyes before I go to bed. Uh-huh. What's it like to blink? Well, it's sort of like this. Everything is there. Okay. And then just for a quick second, everything is not there. Well, what do you do during that one second? That must be a scary moment. Well, it's 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 sort of like a quick trip into the oblivion. Yeah, you got to be ready to Cuz your that. imagination must get carried away. Must think, "Oh my god, where am I? I could be anywhere. I could be in Africa, I could be in Antarctica." Oh, but then boom, no, now you're back. No proof of anything and then you're back. Yeah, you're right. It's like a quick trip around the world. That is exactly what it is. Cuz I always know where I am exactly. Even though my eyes are not in perfect, they're not I have like double kind of I wasn't going to say anything. No, they're a little off, so I no, think I, I, okay, I wasn't going to I say know anything. it's okay. I, no, I'll bring it up. Great. I'm not no, self- they look fine. It's I'm not a... self-conscious. I'm okay. Oh. Um All right. Well, that's good because they're a little fucked up. What's the best part of being a human? Is there anything else you like? You I mean cuz I mean I've always kind of wondered the flesh, man. The f- the, the flesh is uh, quite a toy. You know what I'm saying? I have no idea what you're saying. Oh. <laughs> Someday, Ted. Someday I'll be a real boy? Someday. What am I, a Pinocchio situation? <laughs> I'd like to think it could happen. I would like to hope so. Yeah, I mean, never rule it out. Never say never. You know, I mean, it's uh, like... When you're a guy like me, now I'm a pretty good-looking guy. I'm not fat. Yeah, so I have a, yeah. d- d- uh, so I, I, I pretty much have my shit together looks-wise. I wear a a nice suit on stage. I don't have a great deal of vulnerability, you know. Like when a big fat ass walks on stage, then people are like, "Oh, look, it's right now." They they better he better prove that he's got something. Exactly, we'll laugh at him because he needs the laughter. He's a big fat right. The sympathy laugh. So they're like, they're giving you nothing. Yeah, or if somebody is stupid, if they have a birth defect, or if they're a woman. You know, then there, there's this automatic kind of like, oh, it's... Oh, right. oh well, women, oh, right. right, what's she going to do, right? Right, right, right exactly. exactly. So exactly. they're like, oh, let's laugh at her, because she's not a threat. Yeah, but you see, I'm I... a genuine threat to people. They don't know what they... They're like, who is this guy? Is he going to take me to court? Or, you know, who, this guy, they think, right. associate me with power. I'm a power guy, and this is a problem for people. So I have to kind of find a way. Maybe if I was blind, I said, like if I was doing no, that might be the thing. advantage or something. Or, or you should right. go in like on a wheelchair or something. Just go the ultimate, just wheel on in chaotically and just say, hello. Some... I'm a comedian. <laughs> exactly. Wheel right. Or bring a puppet on talk, stage and, and they'll like immediately that, think you're crazy. Right. I brought a puppet today. That's what I would say. That would right. Be my opening line. I think that's your new act, and then you're going to always. Would you, would you mind just a little? Just think. Oh, oh yeah, right. No offense. I, mean, I, I, I didn't mean anything by it. I, it's, I've got boundary issues. Just a little bit, yeah. Uh, how's this? Is this good enough? Is that far enough no, space? I mean, a little, a little, a little further. Oh. I don't mean to be an asshole. No, 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 it's okay. I don't want to yeah. get too close. I mean, right. I need to give you your space. So yeah, appreciate it. Okay. All right. Okay. So this is, is relatively good now? It's uh, that's better, but a, just a little... Just give me a little more... All right. I just oh, no, no, it's fine. I mean, I like. I don't like to get too close to people yeah, when I interview like them. To be able to, right. You know, spread out a little uh, further. So anyway, when you were working on comedy, uh, I mean, if you don't mind, just to, if you wouldn't mind, just a little. Oh, oh yeah, sure. That, space. All right. So okay. So I guess I just kind of move right. right. That's perfect. I. Well, what? what